Today is another special day uh, because the industry is growing and um, people are feeding, people are earning and um, the GDP of the country as usual is being helped or is being influenced you know, by what we do. Uh, today this film that we are about to see is Omugwa. And it's a film in partnership. It's an um, African Magic Commission film in partnership with um, Golden Effects Pictures and Kunle Alpha Lion. Uh, we were commissioned to do three films, and um, this is one of them. After this, we're going to unveil Roti, and after Roti, we will unveil um, the Tribunal. I'm very excited about these films because, yes, they're meant to be, you know, small budget television, but by the time you see it, you, you ask me what defines or what differentiates a low budget from a big budget. Because it's just like any, you know, Kunle uh, Afalayan production. Um, so I don't want to waste our time. Please, when the film starts, no camera. If you need clips from the film, you can talk to one of our people. We'll give you clips for you to use when you edit. Um, but all cameras should be off. And after this session, there's going to be introduction of some of the cast that are on their way. And I have a representative of African Magic, our partner. We have a representative here. And I also have a representative of um, Bank, of, Bank of Industry, where I am a, a, a consultant or board member, you know, to Nolly Fund. And also, I'm a beneficiary of Nolly Fund as well. Um, that's clapping. Okay. Yeah, but That's good. I mean, I mean, I, I shot CEO with you know funds from BI, and by God's grace, we will pay back. It's by, it's by force. Um. So uh, I have. Uh, I. I was privileged to work with some amazing talent in these films. Most of them I've never worked with them before. And, you know, on that set, we had so much fun. Uh, it's a comedy, of course. Uh, I've done a comedy before, but, you know, a lot of people just see most of my work as being too serious. So I said, okay, let's water it a bit, but with their production value. And that was what gave back to this. Um, so without wasting your time, and uh, this film will be released in case I, I'll try not to forget later. This film is releasing this Friday. Yeah. And this is the premiere. So can we clap for ourselves for making the premiere? <laughs> this is the first public screening of this film. Nobody, and after this, na cinema, you know, before the owner take their film. Um, so enjoy the movie, and um, after this we'll do Q&A and then we can take premier pictures and then we can spread the news. Thank you and uh, welcome. Also, um, I have a brand here that, you know, we, we met not quite long, but uh, they have decided to be part of what we do and we're starting with this and I'm, I'm talking about Techno Mobile. And um, so if you want phone, eh, just see me, free phone. No worry, see me in camera. We're going to be doing a lot with Techno Mobile, and um, you will see why. Anyway, welcome to Silverbed. Uh, Silverbed Distribution is distributing this film, and it's going to be everywhere. Thank you, enjoy the movie. Thank you. 
partnership with Africa Magic and I have a representative of Africa Magic here, Efusa. Mr. Efusa, can you come out please? Can we give Africa Magic a round of applause? Thank you very much. Um, hey Joe, if you like the film, please help tell people the film is releasing on Friday, 7th of April in all the cinemas in Nigeria, wow. you know. Um, thank you. And uh, I have the gate man, uh, you know, that was Kappa's gate man. He's a very good friend of mine, and he really helped with a lot of things, logistics, a lot of things. We use his house. Mr. Ariel Adi, can you stand up, please? Please come out, come out. Come out. Thank you very much. Okay. So, um, uh, thank you very much for agreeing to be part of this project. Um, as you can see, I think we 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 did our bit. We we'll leave the rest to God. And um, again, I say thank you to all of you for coming. Bosa, do you want to say something on behalf of Africa Magic? Um, so, thank you, Fundi, and thank you all for coming. Nothing else to say, but, you know, amazing, amazing work. I'm sure everybody here agrees. Um, it's not the first time we're partnering with, uh, with Kunle. It certainly will be the last time. I can tell you, you know, it's, it's incredible work. I'm going to go back and tell the team. Uh, we didn't expect anything less. I was surprised, pleasantly surprised, you know, with everything that you did. I didn't quite expect or understand where it was going to go, but yeah, I never experienced it. <laughs> um, but very well done, very well done. Africa Magic is proud uh, to partner with you once again. We're proud that you are advancing Nigerian film, African cinema, and it's a journey that we're willing to take with you. So once again, very well done. And well done to everybody here as well. Thank you, it's a pleasure. Thank you very much. So um, we have a media wall outside. We're going to do group photographs and um, interviews. We have the media from everywhere, all over. So it will be nice to, to be part of this. Once again, I say thank you very much for being part of this. Help spread the news. And have a good day. Thank you.
afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Um, movie premiere of Mugwa today. How do you feel watching the movie and what have you learned and what is your advice for everyone at home there? Well, I'll start with the advice. I would advise everybody out there to go watch the movie. It's an amazing movie. Very well done, very well produced and directed. Um, it's classic only for as we know him, um, but you know this movie only shows how versatile he is. You know we know him to produce very well-made thrillers. Uh, this is a, this is the first time partnering with him on a comedy, and you know the cast was excellent, script writing, directing, everything. You know, excellent. An amazing movie. It teaches you a thing or two and entertains you at the same time and it makes you laugh. So it's a perfect movie, and I urge the viewers out there to go watch it. What really did you learn? I'm sure you watched it today. What really did you personally learn today? And you need to tell people out there too about it. I think Omugwa teaches you patience, tolerance, um, understanding, um, particularly for young couples and you know different, and particularly you know for mixed couples from mixed backgrounds, you know different ethnic groups. It teaches us tolerance. It teaches us understanding. It teaches us that we can talk through problems um, to jaw jaw and not war war. You know, not every time you escalate issues. Sometimes you sit down and have a conversation, and then you find out that you can basically thrash anything that you know life throws at you. So it's a movie, as I said, that teaches you a thing or two and entertains you. So it's a perfect movie for families, for young couples, for anybody who just wants to learn something while learning a bit about Nigerian culture and things that, like Omugwa is you know proudly Nigerian. Um, it's a practice that even though it comes from one side of the country has sort of been adopted by other climes. Um, so yeah, so it's a movie that teaches you a thing or two. My name is Efosa and I'm Head of Public Relations and Talents for Mnet West Africa and Africa Magic. Keep watching Olori Supergirl TV. Good sir. Um, this one is mainly for the mothers, if I know wrong. Which one? I'm, I'm sure you are having something prepared for the fathers too. Yeah, of course, but this is for everybody if you ask me. This is a, su a successful outing and I'm glad people like the film. So go out there on the 7th of April and see the film Omogo. Thank you. Good afternoon, Mama Sunday. Good afternoon. I'm sure you really enjoyed the 7th movie. How do you feel acting that crap? Wow. You know, sometimes when you're on set, sometimes you film up until like 3 a.m., 4 a.m. It's, um, it's challenging. But because of the passion, and because you know that you're part, you're part of, a, you're, you're part of a, a nation, you're part of Africans telling their stories, you know, you're part of the, the new movement of Africans telling their stories to the world, you know, us showcasing our, showcasing our culture and tradition to the world. You just keep going. So now that I have seen the fruit of our labor, I'm extremely happy. It's, it turned out well. I'm, I'm very grateful to God Almighty, you know, for making me first a woman and of course an African and then a filmmaker, yes. So. Um, you play the role of a modern day mother. Um, how would you narrate this or what is your advice for those outside acting exactly the way you just acted in the movie? <laughs> okay, um, first thing first, gone are the days where we should see women are just, uh, as just one, one, one gender that should just give birth and that's it. You can be strong, you can be, you can be the best in whatever industry and yet be a good mother. Well, I would say, I'm not a mother, but I would say kudos to every woman, kudos to every woman trying to make sure that um, their home front is good, kudos to every woman who is surviving and who is being a trail setter at their work and their careers and their businesses, kudos to every woman who has ever carried a child and who has ever trained a child, kudos to every woman who does all of this and still is a wife to her husband, kudos to every woman who keeps the family front right. Yes, kudos to motherhood. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. You play the role of a century grandmother. For real? Yeah, no. How do you feel playing that act? Um, excited. <laughs> Even though it was a naughty mommy, but yeah. Isn't there? She was all over the place doing some stuff. So, grandmas, please watch out. Don't be like can dance. So, don't be like can dance them. Um. So, um, on Omogo now, um, what would you really advise those people out there now to do, the next thing to do for them? No, they should take care. The next thing to do for them. <laughs> they should do Omogo for their kids, really. How would you say? Well, it's my son. I have a boy. If he gets married and um, they have a, they, I have a grandchild, I would definitely do Omogo for her or a boy, whichever. I will be there for them. You just have to be there for them, actually. Yep. Good afternoon, sir. How are you? You are a cast in um, Omugwa. Yes. What would you tell people about Omugwa? Omugwa, it's, um, it's uh, I'll call it an epping hand when you need it most. When you have your wife, 
uh, giving birth to a child, the best thing for you to tap into. Though it's not, it's not, it's not. Um, we from this part of the world, we are not really, really taking it the way they are taking it in the east. But Omugo is something that every. Um, how do I pull them now? Mothers, upcoming mothers, needs to grow. Yeah. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, sir. Yes, how are you? How are you doing, sir? It's another beautiful day watching Omugo premiere today, and we are having you live and direct here. How do you feel about that title, Omugo? Omugo is a name that has uh, been there a long time ago. Like, if you, um, how will I say it now? First, we just born Peking, you know, your, your mom will come around and stay with you for a while. So, that's, I think that's what they call Omugo. And it's Ibu, I think, yes. From the movie you watched, I'm sure you watched it. Um, what is your advice for all mothers that watch this movie? Well, it's very important for mothers to understand that um, their place is, their place are different from the wife's place. Naturally, naturally, the wife is your wife, your mom is your mom, and husbands too should learn how to manage both of them. Because if they don't, because I, I'm a typical example of that. My wife's from Aquaibo, my mom is Yoruba, and they both stay together. And we, when, when it started, it wasn't that easy, but right now we're balanced. We're balanced. So it's just a, a serious lesson for a lot of people to just know that when you come to do a mugo, do a mugo and go back to your house, man. That's the, that's the best thing. It's your son, he will still come back to you, but he's married now to another woman, so. It doesn't mean that that woman will take your place. There's no way. No woman can take your mother's place. And no mother can take your wife's place. That's the way it is. Hi, my name is Kunle Afolani. I'm an actor and a filmmaker. Keep watching. Olori Super Girl.